this is a big game for us because it's a it's Sam Houston and it's a conference ball game. We want to get off to a good start in conference play. Rallying off an outstanding preseason performance, the Big Red anticipates their Southland showdown against conference rival Sam Houston State. Prepared and poised for victory. I feel like we're pretty confident. You know, we're going to come out here, we're going to practice, we're going to put in a really good game plan, and we're going to come out here and play our type of football and play the best we can play. Just like we were any other game, you know, obviously the hype is very high. You know, it's conference, Sam Houston, uh, big game, and, you know, it sets the tone for our, for our uh, conference play. And I think we just got to come out here, uh, be positive, come out here and practice hard and just be ready to play. Even though we 3 and one on the books, I think it's 0-0 zero, zero in our head just because conference, preseason don't mean nothing, conferences at all. And playing Sam Houston, we're really excited just because it's Sam Houston and that determines our season to me and to everybody else on the team. The bittersweet taste of last year's close call remains, motivating the cards to conference. I think in a lot of the players' minds that were here last year, they left the field uh, very proud of their effort, very disappointed, but proud of their effort knowing that toe-to-toe uh, -to -toe they could go and play with these guys. Uh, and it's got to carry over. I, I think we're going to have to play better than they do in all three phases, uh, offensively, defensively, and our kicking game. We're going to have to outplay them. We feel like we got something to prove since they've really been beating us up pretty bad the last four years. I mean, we finally think we have a team to outplay those guys, outsmart those guys, and I'll hustle those guys Saturday. So that's what we're building up on this season, this week. So I think, you know, we played them well. You know, we didn't play mistake-free and perfect ball, but we played them well. We know we can hang with them. Sam Houston claws into action with the new head coach, a wide array of transfers, and fresh faces in the backfield. Nevertheless, Lamar is still aware of how credible a threat the Bearcats are. They're, you know, they're physical, they're big, they're fast, they're athletic, and they're very talented. So we just got to go out there and prepare and, uh, you know, just be ready to, to play our best because that's what we're going to have to do. Well, they have a few athletes across the board and everything, but if we just go out there and just play our offense and play within ourselves and everything, we should come out and move the ball very well and uh, win. They just do so much. It's really not one thing that they do special or it's not one thing that they're really great at. Like last year, they was really great at the run with Tim Flanders back there, but this year they got all kind of quick passes. Zone, zone runs, split flow zone, all kind of stuff like that. So we just got to focus on all of them and try to cut back the mistakes and go get them. The Cards are on the brink of their opening game in Southland Conference play. And as they soar into the weekend, they do so as the top scoring offense in the SLC, giving them nowhere to go. But up. The O line is everything. Without the O line, we're not moving the ball, period. So. O line, I mean, they're, uh, they're pretty pumped up about this week. They've been working hard and everything, so we should have a good game this Saturday. They're always the key to, to playing uh, well offensively. If you can protect, if you can run the ball, both of those, you got to credit your offensive line. So uh, they're always a big part of what we do. Uh, it's very important, not just in the passing game, but the running game as well. Uh, you know, I think they're the key to our offense, how they do is how we're going to do. The road to success for the Cards begins at the line of scrimmage on both sides of the ball. A journey paved by discipline and execution. For the Big Red Sports Network, I'm Jordan Washington.